Hey there, Chad Bonger here for Ohio University Libraries. In this video, I will show you how to use Mergent Online to get industry averages and industry ratios across a list of competitors or companies that you select. So here you go. So we'll begin at Mergent here just by searching for a company within our industry. So in this case, I'm looking for uh, Time Warner Cable. So we'll just search by ticker there, click on the, the, uh, the company. And you get all kinds of financial information in here. You'll notice there are, um, under fi company financials, there are ratios and things like that, but that will just be only for one company there. Uh, so if you want to compare multiple companies, the way you can do this is uh, go under competitors here. And you'll get a nice list of competitors according to Mergent. Now, some of these companies you may say, well, I don't really want to compare those. So if you want to, don't want General Electric, for example, you can get rid of that one and get rid of Disney, um, maybe get rid of... Um, uh, Time Warner Incorporated, maybe get rid of you know some of the some of the companies that don't really make sense uh, being in there. Uh, this list is based largely on NAICS code and sub-industry codes and things like that. So some of the things may be kind of assigned arbitrarily. So you won't, might want to go through and delete some things in there. And you'll notice if we go through our list here, like DirecTV is not in there. So we want to add DirecTV. We can just go under and type in uh, Direct. Um, uh, direct TV or we can go in there and type in DTV and get um, uh, get the company there click the company click add and it will appear in our list there so you can go do that for whatever kind of companies you want to do and once you do that you'll go over here and see you know, there's a link here to, to add all to our company analysis list so we do that and now we have 17 companies in our list here and so if you want to go back and add more, you can go back and, and continue to add companies here. Okay. Uh, now, so the, the industry that we're defining is kind of relative to the companies that we are selecting. So we are kind of identifying, in addition to what Merchant has identified, uh, companies that are in our industry here. So the ratios that we create in our next report may be slightly different than other places have, simply because they may have used other companies to compare. So bear that in mind. And in, in, in your citations, you probably want to say, these are the companies that I'm, that I'm using um, to, uh, to make my industry analysis here. So we'll click on Add All Companies to our Company Analysis List, and then we'll click on our Company Analysis List. Now here's an important step here. Um, before you go and add companies over here, you want to click on the Company Comparison Report here on the left side. And that will give us a different screen here. And I'm just going to go ahead and add all companies here. You can, you can X out of the ones you don't want. I'm going to go and click add all those over there. And then we'll go down. You see there's financial information. We're going to go into ratios here. And basically you can just go in and just add whatever ratios you want to um, over here on the side here. So, um, you know, typically things like quick and operating margin and net profit margin, those are usually um, uh, return on assets, return on equity, things like that, return on investment. Okay, so as we do that, you'll see our list fills up over here. Now I'm just going to do latest. If you wanted to do multiple uh, years, you could actually go down and actually hit the control key or shift key rather and select all. I'm just going to do latest for the sake of time. Um, to get the industry average or the average across the peers that you've selected here, you want to click this box right here. And then if you scroll down the very bottom, there is a link to create a report. And this is actually outside of my my video frame here. Let me move this over a little bit. Uh, there's a link to create a report. Uh, you, you can create a report down here in the bottom right, but what you want to do is actually select your format. You can select a Excel document. I'm just going to do HTML to kind of show you what this looks like on the screen and then click create report. And this will open our report in the new window and here is the data for those companies there. Uh, with the peer average, and they call it peer average, not industry average, because we are comparing the pre-selected peers that we want to select there, and then there is um, the data that we have available uh, for um, for those companies. If you want to, you can actually sort on the column just by clicking on the column uh, and that sort of thing. So uh, you'll notice some of these companies are no longer active. Uh, if you wanted to, you can go back in and redo the search and delete those as well. So that's how you find uh, ratios, uh, industry ratios, and peer ratios for companies using uh, Mergent Online. Hopefully this video helps you. Should you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. I'd be glad to help you any way I can. Take care and best of luck with your research.